Captain's log, stardate 52861.3. We have just entered the Tevron system to meet up with the USS Sovereign, which is currently being escorted by two Klingon vessels. Diaz, could you scan the area, please? Initiating scan. That's the Sovereign, Captain. And two birds of prey. Shall I hail the Sovereign, sir? Make it so, Ensign. Channel open. Captain Soto, sir. On screen. Congratulations on your promotion to command, Captain. I'm glad to see you here. Repairs are progressing, but we only have a skeleton crew on board, so it's taking some time. We've had to take the impulse engines offline, so we're immobile until the repairs are complete. Incoming message, sir. Captain Draxon of the Rancouf, sir. On screen. Hail, Captain. Your timely arrival frees my ship and the Traor to depart for Biranu Station. However, there is something you must know before we leave. My tactical officer reported suspicious readings on his scanners on our way here. Suspicious in what way, sir? Two very faint readings, fading in and out. He thinks we may have been followed by at least two vessels, cloaked. Your scanners could be out of sync. Not on my ship, Lieutenant. No! I speak truth. I would stay, but our duty demands we reach Biranu Station on our timetable. Be on guard, Captain. Excuse Jackson me, sirs, out. but we have company. On screen. Two warbirds uncloaking to starboard. They're hailing us, sir. On screen. Greetings, Captain. I am Torren, commanding the warbird Soyak. With respect, Captain, do you have some business with us? The Romulan Star Empire is well aware of the incident in the Vesuvi system. That was troubling. Now we have further cause for concern. The Enterprise has been patrolling the Maelstrom for quite some time. Now Starfleet has introduced this second Sovereign-class ship to the Maelstrom. A somewhat disputed area. We must question the reasons for its presence and its relationship to the Vesuvi event. I can assure you neither Starfleet nor the Federation knows any more than you do about the cause of the Vesuvi incident. Two Sovereign-class vessels raise vast suspicions, Commander. Suspicions we are prepared to act on. Now. Sir, the Klingons have raised their shields and are powering up weapons. The Klingons have opened fire, Captain. Very well. Firing on the Sovereign. We shall play. The Sovereign has taken some hits. Incoming transmission. On screen. Dauntless. We're losing shield integrity. Down 25%. I'm shifting more power to the shield, but I don't think they'll hold. The Dauntless is yours, Captain. Shields up. Red alert. Dauntless, we are attacking the Hadebach. Join us. Out. Report, Lieutenant. Looks like the Klingons are doing a good job at distracting the Warbird. Target their shield generators. Fire. Their left shield is draining, Captain. Good. Keep it up. I need everything we've got to the shields. Keep firing, Ensign. Falling back for an attack run. Aim for their cloaking device. Sweeping through phaser arcs. Report. Taking out their impulse engines would remove their ability to maneuver. That's a good idea, Ensign. Let's do it. Target their impulse engines and fire on my mark. Fire. Captain, you have collapsed their bottom shield. Damage report! Hull integrity at 100%. Good. Shields are at 100%. Status on the Romulans, Lieutenant. Looks like we've bloodied their noses a bit. They're turning about and cloaking. It's past time for us to go on to Biranu Station, Captain. Although, this has been an interesting skirmish. I am also due at Biranu Station, Captain Draxon. With your permission, I will transfer to your ship for the final leg of the journey. We will be honored by your presence, Captain. Make your preparations and transport to us when you are ready. Draxon out. I'll take my leave of you now, Captain. Good luck. Thank you, Captain. Incoming message from the Zukov, sir. On screen. Dauntless, we have been assigned to complete the escort of the Sovereign to Space Dock. We will stand by until she is ready. You may proceed to the Vesuvi system to supply the surviving colonies there. Verata, out. Transmission from Sovereign, sir. On screen. We've been able to make sufficient repairs to allow us to warp, Captain. We're heading on to Starbase 12 with the Zukov. Thanks for your help. Soto out. 
Ensign set a course for the Vesuvi system. Course laid in. Warp 9, engage. Yes, Captain. Sir, we are receiving an emergency transmission. It's pretty garbled. I'll boost the power to main comma ray. That should clean it up. This is the Cardassian freighter Karoo. A Romulan vessel has attacked us. We have sustained heavy damage to our antimatter containment pods and are operating on emergency power. Please acknowledge. There's too much subspace interference to open a channel at this distance. The signal appears to emanate from the edge of the Beol system near Beol 4. Shall I set course? Captain, we must respond to this distress call. Well, I'd expect nothing less, Commander. Ensign, set a course. Course laid in. Maximum warp, engage. Yes, Captain. Leaving orbit. Arriving at Beol 4, sir. Dropping out of warp. The Karoon is signaling, sir. Audio only. We are taking heavy damage. Lost the signal, sir. Their comma ray may have been damaged in the attack. I'm reading two unknown contacts in this system, Captain. Full scan. Initiating scan. It's a Cardassian freighter in a warbird, sir. The warbird is towing the Karoon toward the system's asteroid belt. Why the asteroid belt? The asteroids would interfere with her communications. She wouldn't be able to send out another SOS. Mm. The Romulans could take her apart at their leisure. Red alert. They're being hailed. Red alert. Shields up. Ah, you again. Uh. Captain Turen, stand down immediately. You are attacking a ship protected by interplanetary law. So the law protects smugglers, does it? The treaty signed at the end of the Dominion War forbids the rearming of Cardassia's military. Scan them yourselves. I have no more time to waste with you. Torren out. I want you to target their tractor beams and aim to disable, Ensign. The War Karun burned. is drifting toward the asteroid belt. Her engines are still down. Sir, I'm getting a weak signal from her. Audio only. Federation vessel managed to patch communications. Emergency power is fading. We're coming, Karoon. Hold on. I can't detect the warbird. We should bring the Karoon's speed to zero. Otherwise, it may drift into another asteroid. Lieutenant Tractor Beam on the Karoon. Get us closer. Hailing frequencies open. No response. Sir, the Karoon has been destroyed. Escape pods? No escape pods or transporter signals. The Karoon was destroyed with all hands. Captain, I must report to Starfleet your inability to aid the Karoon. Captain, interstellar law demands that we aid any ship in distress. Your hesitation in effecting a rescue of the Karoon raises serious doubts. You will return to Starbase 12, where an inquiry into your actions will be convened. Oh! <laughs> okay! Uh, so I actually didn't know what to do there. I was thinking we'd be able to get into tractor beam range and lock onto her and keep her from moving. The only other option we could have possibly had was taking out her engines, but I think she was drifting. Um, yeah, that's really fascinating. I'm going to be back with another episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, comment down below. But until next time, that's me. Out. Bye, guys.